morning, good afternoon, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is Chris again, the Watch Lounge, coming at you with another unboxing. Today's unboxing is four watches, guys. Quick wrist watch check. I am wearing the G-Shock, uh, of course, uh, just for purposes of this unboxing, I was wearing this then. Of course, I kind of cheated already, unboxed these a couple days ago, except for the Hamilton. That's the only one I just got in today, guys. And I'm, I'm looking forward to that one. As you know, that's a new addition to my collection, the Khaki. I've had the Hamilton in before, a couple different iterations, this iteration as well. And love the watch, so I decided to purchase it when I saw a really good deal on Discord, you guys. And the other watches were lent in by my buddy Art uh, Snuggle Tummy. He, he's on Instagram. I'll, I'll leave a link to his Instagram down below. If you want to go follow him, real nice guy. He sent in the Zen 556, which is really a great watch, guys. I've been wearing that one on kind of all weekend. It's, uh, it, it could almost contend for the perfect one watch. And it wasn't for that date window. Of course, you know I'm not a big date window person. It could be the almost perfect watch. He also sent the Seiko Patty in. As you know, I had already had this version of the Seiko Patty before. If you look back in my archives, I own it myself, reviewed it already. But I told him I'd take a look at it because he's a nice guy. He wants to uh, try and sell it. So I'll, I'll let you guys know that it is for sale. Both the Zen and this is for sale. So if you want to message him on Facebook or on uh, Instagram, excuse me, guys, uh, I'll leave the link down there below. And the Islander, this is the Red October. This is Lennon from my buddy Bobby over at Bobby Legs channel. I'll link his channel down below. He was kind enough to send this one in. He is also selling this, his uh, Red October. He kind of picked it up for the channel. It's a great watch, guys. But anyways, guys, on the unboxing itself, I will save the Hamilton for last. Again, I have not seen this one yet. You have to excuse me. I'm kind of getting over a cold or it's starting to get a cold now, guys. So bear with me here. Um, here's the Seiko. Nothing too crazy, kind of nice packaging, guys. And this is the uh, 055, I believe, the SBDC 055, if I remember correctly. It's got that cool uh, multi-color wave dial, the black and blue. And it wears really great with that cushion case, guys, as I know from my past experience owning it. I do kind of want to pick up the uh, regular blue dial version, it's the 053, so I am on the lookout for that. So there's that one. Thank you. Snuggle Tummy again, Art. I'm lending that one in. I'll put this box to the side here. And then on to the Zen. This is the 556 again. Like I said, I've been kind of wearing this one all weekend. Nothing too crazy usual Zen fanfare, guys. Right over to the side. And then here is the Zen. Nothing too crazy in the box. This is the 556, five, guys. Like I said, great watch. This could almost contend for somebody's one watch collection. If they wanted a one watch. This thing wears perfect, even on my set of it wears that 38mm case size fits perfect. And this is a very versatile piece. Really high end. It's comparable, dare I say, to a Mega Aqua Terror territory. And about a fraction of the price, guys. And that's just personal opinion, by the way. Now, on to the Islander. This is one that you've already seen. Mark's already had this kind of version out. But he did limit these to 200 pieces. And I'll take this uh, off its pillowcase. Just to show you guys the case back here. Of course, here is what it looks like. The Dow. Kind of reminiscent of a Yachtmaster Rolex. And then here is the case back, guys. That Red October, pretty cool, limited to 200. I'm sure he's going to do another run of these guys. And if you're like me, you're a big uh, Tom Clancy fan, you know, Hunt for the October, which is kind of what it was named after by one of his viewers. Pretty cool nickname, I feel like, of course, that Red Secondhand. And then going with the nautical theme. Now, we will get to the Hamilton. And this is one, like I said, I had bought from, with my own money. I bought it off Discord member. Nothing too crazy in the box there, guys. Sorry, I'm kind of running out of room. <laughs> These unboxings are getting bigger and bigger every time, it seems like. Pretty nice box overall. First impressions on the box, at least, are really nice. I don't think I had the box in before, because I didn't know it. Somebody added some in the white dial version from Tintin Talk, and this is the version I bought. Again, I did not buy it off of him. I bought uh, off a member from Discord, Random Rob's Discord. And I couldn't pass the price up. Let's just say... 
I won't tell you the price of it. But let's just say it is cheaper than the any Black Friday deal you can get out there. And it looks to be in pretty like new condition, guys. This will definitely be a new daily wear alongside the G-Shock. Anyways, guys, let me know what you think down in the comments below. What do you think about this unboxing? You looking forward to the full reviews? You looking at buying any of these pieces here? To add to your collection, I, my, my collection itself is starting to expand, guys. As I did just pick up the Hamilton and I have the Islander on the way. Once they get here, I will do a state of the collection as I just got my Orient back. From Bobby as well. He just re reviewed this. I was kind of missing this piece, believe it or not. But I will do a state of the collection once that Islander gets in here. And, and my collection's changed a lot, guys. Let me know if you want to see that video. And if you guys stuck to the end here and listened to my ramblings, thank you. I really, really appreciate you guys. And if you haven't already, please like, subscribe, comment down below. Let me, let me know what you think. And I gotta start cracking out the reviews because I still have this 7 from Roman as well to review. So I guess start getting busy guys and I will see you in the next one. Peace.